So we're going to move on to the uh, ruler snap uh, button here. Um, and you notice that it's, um, it's not accessible. You can't select it right now. In order to be able to turn on ruler snap, we have to click the near button. Notice how ruler snap and projection snap turned on. So let's turn off axi mode. And so if we select ruler snap, let's select it, notice that the ruler snap modes turn on and the value uh, section also turns on as well. Division doesn't work in this mode. If we click on relative, then it shows up. Okay, so <clears throat> with that being said, ruler snap is on. Let's go and grab our line tool, our trusty line tool. And it's in centimeter, 10 centimeters mode. So right now it's kind of just clicking very, you know, it, it looks like it's moving smoothly. So what I think we need to do here in this case to demonstrate this is to up this. So let's, uh, let's try 50 centimeters. See how it's clicking now? It's popping and snapping. I should probably use the word snapping instead of popping, but because uh, it's the snap, the snap panel, the ruler snap. Okay, let's make it a little higher. Let's make it 100 centimeters, which is a meter. And see how it pops into place. So basically, it's it's hitting the line, but when it jumps, when you're snapping, when you do your initial snap, it jumps 100 centimeters. Okay, so, whoop, let's uh, undo that. Let's grab our line tool again. Um, what if we went two? Two meters. Now it's jumping even more. So basically, it's sort of a way you can measure things and it will jump in the increments that you select. So right now it's jumping at two meters. Okay, if we go four. Sorry, let's uh, undo that. So, bunk, four, and four. Okay, so that's sort of the basic of it. Let's uh, undo that. Let's go and try relative mode. Now it says divisions of 10. And sorry, let's grab our line tool. And see what it does. It selects the edge here. And now we can kind of click through levels of 10. So if you needed to keep drawing lines on this edge here, you can make it pop. And um, if you were templating something out to create something, you could draw lines and connect them in at perfect uh, division of 10. So that would be equal amount of space. So um, so it, it is uh, actually kind of practical what, what you could actually do with this if you needed to take a surface and have it divided up, um, say, 10 times with an equal distance. Um, let's see if we can pull off the same thing using our... Um, our circle here. Let's grab our line tool and it's in uh, absolute mode or in relative mode. And actually, it doesn't seem to be working in this particular case. What about? Oh, see, it seems to work on a straight line. See, look, it does it on. Uh, 
this line as well. So I'm not sure. I don't think it, it looks like it doesn't work uh, with circular objects. Okay. Notice it doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything for that circle. But it automatically will take an edge, a straight edge, and divide it up. Okay, divide it up 10 times. So we could go, what if we made it 5? Okay. Let's uh, undo that. Grab our line. See how it's the increments now are in divisions of it's in divisions of five. Okay, just one more time to iterate the tool. If we wanted 20 divisions, same dealio, grab our line, bonk. See how it divides it up into 20. Okay, so as you can see so far, there's a lot of different ways to uh, make things snap. Different types of increments, different whether it's points, vertices, tangents, intersections, in, uh, perpendiculars, centering, so on and so forth. So there's a lot of different ways to, basically this is the snapping aspect of Lightwave CAD is so that you can line things up perfectly. Okay, if you're especially when you're building, making buildings and things like that, you want every you want things to be just so. Um, like I said, this is a real great way uh, using Lightwave CAD uh, to make things in exact measurements. So there's all these little tools in this snap panel um, that will allow you to have that type of uh, precision in your in your work and in your modeling. Okay, so I think that's about it for our ruler snap. Uh, we're going to stop here and we'll be back in a moment.